Uh, good morning, ladies and gents. This is Andrew with Creative Crush, and uh, we are at Sweet Ob. Sweeto burrito is basically you take Nacho Libre. If the guy from Nacho Libre, Ignacio, I think is his name, if Ignacio was to belly flop on a burrito, that's what Sweeto burrito would be. I mean, you gotta show him that. I thought you told me this was a good restaurant. Good is relative. There's, there's our, uh, there's our, this is the world we've entered here. So just think luchador and burrito and then you got your Sweeto Burrito. All right, so you've been here before. I've been here before. And you say they have burritos with like french fries mm -hmm. and hash browns. If, yeah, and hash mouths. Hash mouths, yes. Smoke weed every day, smoke every day. <laughs> if you're looking for like an authentic burrito experience, do not come here. This place is for white people. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Anybody can come here, but it is not like an authentic burrito. Yeah, this is this isn't a real. It's good but though. I feel like I'm, I'm making sweeto sweeto burrito sound like it's bad because it's not. Because what they do, they they do it right. So, they specialize in making, I guess, novelty burritos. For example, I just ordered the buff chick, which is uh, buffalo chicken with cheese and tater tots, um, and I think some rice and a couple other sauces. There's the All-American, which is basically a cheeseburger meal wrapped up in a tortilla. You got your cheese, your hamburger, your french fries, your fry <laughs> sauce. It's, it's your authentic American burger destination in a burrito, in a, burrito in, in a tortilla shell. So. so you get the best of both worlds, I guess. Okay, and we've got another guest joining us here. This oh, is, uh, we've got Amy here. This is Amy, the founder of Sweet Burrito. So uh, tell us about tell us about your experiences in found, founding this company. Um, I just wanted to make a place where luchadors could feel welcome. That is so courageous. Yeah. You, su you succeeded. Yeah, I just feel like tots and um, yeah are the way to a luchador's heart. Mm -hmm. I think so. Too. Tots and ketchup. This whole time I thought it was uh, sweatpants. No, no, no. That Although I do too. wear stretchy pants. All day, every day. <laughs> In your free time, yes. All right, so uh, we're gonna put this on pause and we'll wait for our food to come back. We'll, we'll do a taste test, we'll let you know what we think of it. All right, so uh, we've got our food now. We've got uh, two different varieties of burrito here. We've got the assassin and the buff chick. So we're a- uh, Buff? Buff chick. Chick. Buff. Now you said it, it contains buff. buffalo meat? Buffalo chicken. So it's buffalo meat and chicken. No. no, just buffalo chicken. Oh, so it's buffalo style chicken. Yeah. Okay, all right. So we're going to try this out. We're going to see a, see which one we like. People in the West don't eat buffaloes because they're extinct in the West. The freaking Antelope Island is covered because, in buffaloes. Because the white man killed all the buffaloes. Just like how they if, made if, this restaurant. If you want an HD close-up for what's inside. Just like how they made this restaurant. You well, got, let's hold it still for a second so it can focus. There you go. You got the tater tots. You got the buffalo chicken in there. You got Amy's face in there. <laughs> and buffalo sauce. All right, so um, dink it. <laughs> oh, Lord. Let's steal something from a great channel. Which one do you have? Give the buff chick? Mmm. Oh, wow. That's tasty. It's yeah. a good combination of, of spicy, mm. but sweet, flavorful. Mm -hmm. It's tasty. It's good. How's yours? It's great. Never fails. I always get this one. Look at that chickeny mm. goodness. Mm. You want to try the other ones now? Amy? I really like it. Can I try yours? And then you try mine? But who doesn't love breaded chicken? Yeah. It's true. Basically, you could put breaded chicken in, wrapped in spinach and I'd still love it. Oh, yeah. Actually, put, we should try put, that. Yeah. You could put spinach inside chicken and I'd like it. Yeah. yeah. You could put breaded chicken in like a banana split and I'd like it. Okay. Well, it's we so should bad. do that sometime. Yeah. Mm. Oh, wow. Mm. This is more traditional. Mm -hmm. This is really good. What is the Very sauce on this? It's a sweet, spicy sauce. Have you had the assassin? 
the carne asada is really good. The mm. carne is amazing. That's really good. Mm. Alright, which one do you prefer, Amy? Mm. They're both good for different reasons. Yeah. I agree. They're both um, tasty. I think I'm going to have to go with... I like the breaded chicken more because... Because it's breaded chicken. Because I'm a slave to breaded chicken. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Which but is, man, this was delicious. Yeah. I think this one's really quite good. And the sauce on this is amazing. When I called you and told you what was on the menu, you sounded very skeptical. Yeah. Because it's kind of a weird idea. Mm-hmm. Right? Yeah. It, it sounds a lot worse than it tastes. Mm-hmm. But it tastes pretty dang good. Yeah. I have to say, uh, I like this restaurant. I, I give it, I give it a solid uh, grapefruit and an avocado. Grapefruit I would and avocado. definitely eat here again. Yeah, me too. I would give it five tater tots. Yeah. Out, ice, of, ice. out of five tater tots. Dude, totally. I would give it one breaded chicken in with an avocado glaze over it. Mm. Oh. All right. That's very generous. <laughs> All right, ladies and gents, thanks for watching. We'll get creative again with you next time. Thanks for watching. Mm. Mm. Be sure to subscribe. Um, go to Sweeto Burrito. Treat yourself. Look at this. Get one of these. <laughs>